Hi guys, how are we doing? In this session, I'm gonna show you my kit. So um, I know a lot of you guys know that I make uh, films on professional cameras as well as making films on smartphones. Um, and I use all of this kit in this tutorial. So I thought it'd be worthwhile just showing you um, the kit that I use uh, and whatnot. So first and foremost, obviously I use my iPhone and I'm shooting off an iPhone 11. Um, so I'm using that phone right now to film this tutorial. So obviously I can't show you that. But I also sometimes use my uh, daughter's phone. This is an iPhone 7 Plus um, as a backup phone or as an extra phone. And I also use an old iPod because again, an iPod is essentially an iPhone without a SIM card, right? So I use that as well. Um, I have a selection of moment lenses. So I don't know if you can, can see those there. So this is the uh, 1.33 anamorphic lens. So anamorphic is the two, three, five, one aspect ratio. And I shoot a lot off that um, because it's really cinematic anyway. Um, I also use this telephoto lens. So this is a 58 millimeter telephoto lens. And um, that comes in really handy because obviously I don't have uh, the iPhone 11 Pro, so I don't have the, the zoom lens. So that one comes in handy if I want to zoom in a little bit, etc. I also have a Rode shotgun microphone, which uh, plugs directly into my iPhone via the little white adapter cable. And again, that's really useful for capturing um, good quality sound, especially if I'm if I'm not outside. Um, I also have the Osmo Mobile 3, which as you can see here, and that's really great for when I'm trying to get those cinematic sweeping movements. Um, again, you know, through my tutorial, you know you can do that without having a gimbal, but it, you know, sometimes it's just, it's, it's really useful. Um, I also have a little light that I can put on either my stand here or I can put on another stand or I could put it on top of my camera. And this is the Manfrotto art light. And again, really great if I'm in an environment that's quite dark lighting or I want to have subject lighting over something. I also have a, a Manfrotto little mini tripod that I can put my camera on um, if I want to do low shots or time lapses. And I have a standard camera, which my iPhone is on right now, filming this. Again, it's a lightweight thing, just if I want to get more higher, steady shots, etc. The other thing that I have um, with me is I have this thing here, and this is recording my audio right now. And I'm going to overlay that on this tutorial because I want you to see the difference um, between iPhone audio and professional audio. So this is a Zoom H6n and it's an audio recorder. So right now I'm using it as an interface with my laptop, which is also part of my kit. Um, because sometimes you want to edit off a laptop and not just edit off your phone if, if I'm not on location. So at the minute it's an audio interface, but also this also doubles up as a voice recorder. So if I take this off, it's actually got a microphone that I can voice record. So if I'm doing interviews, maybe I'm outside, I might get my subject to hold it here and it acts as a microphone, and then I sync the audio together in post. Um, so I have my trusty mobile Wi-Fi, because if you're like me, you're probably gonna run out of data at some point during the middle of the month, and you might need a little bit extra to get your footage off to where it needs to go. Now, obviously, having mobile Wi-Fi is not essential to filmmaking. It's not even part of filmmaking, it's just something I do. And my final piece of kit, which is actually by far my most important piece of kit, is my trusted coffee cup. I can't go a day without drinking caffeine, so I need that on shoot just to make sure I'm kind of good to go. Um, but on a practical note, um, it's really good for making sure you've got plenty of fluids because you don't know how hot it's going to be or how long you're going to be out there, etc., etc. You know all of this stuff, guys. So that's my kit list. I'd love to see what um, you guys are shooting on. So please do uh, send me a message and show, show your kit and let me see what you're working on. I'd love to see it. All right, guys, have a good day and I'll see you soon.